Oh there. Number one, get yourself some of this uh, plastic film, obscured plastic film from hardware store. Clean your window, both sides. And you can see here I've put one piece on this section, right across, full piece. Um, when you put it on, there's bound to be some bubbles, so get a soft cloth. And rub them out. It took me quite a long time to do this. There's still a few in there, but I think once um, I've cut it, I think they'll come out. But more or less, got everything out by really pushing hard against the plastic. Okay, so that's one piece on there. I'll do the other piece to go on this section shortly. On the other side of the glass, I've got my design cut out to the, the right width. I'm going to tape that onto the window uh, facing in. So now we can see the design coming through there and I'll just follow that round with the craft knife. I'm going to use one of these. Um, it's the best I could find. I would normally prefer to use a scalpel but uh, anyway we'll see how that, that works. There's the design, I'm just going to follow around, cut around these edges and uh, then peel away the excess. I've just made the first cut round here, round here over the top of this leaf and then I've just taken it out there just to uh, try and do it bit by bit and see how it's, how it's coming on. Let's have a look, let's just try taking that top piece off. Just inside this uh, curve here. Let's take, try and take that out. There we go. Okay, you can't see anything much at the moment, but um, just take it out bit by bit. Let's see how we go. It's not all that easy to see, really, but once you've cut one or two pieces out. Um, then it gets easier. Like here, you can kind of see what no idea where the cuts are. But as soon as you've taken some out, so I'd recommend you just do it in small pieces. I've just come around the outside of this curve and around here to the bottom. Um, I think I've got this side of the leaf to do. <laughs> but I'm not exactly sure. It's a bit of trial and error. But I think it'll be okay. You can kind of see it happening. I'm going to try and cut a bit for you. Um, it's not easy to hold the camera and do this, but I'd advise you to try and keep the knife moving and when you get to a point like this, don't take the knife off, just turn it around and keep try and keep moving without, uh, you know, lifting the knife from the plastic. Keep it on as much as you can. Let's just go around the outside edge. Just, you know, a smooth, a smooth cut and move the whole arm. Don't move your wrist. Move the whole arm round. Just to show you that I'm kind of taking it off in sections. I'm just taking the, the big section out here. And kind of the more you cut, the more you can see. But it's not easy, and it's not easy to follow the lines. So. Pick a design that it's not all that um, important. As you're moving around, of course, the, uh, there's because there's a, a gap between the design on one side of the window and the plastic on the other, you get a bit of shift. But you know, it's on the way. This section up here was a bit tricky, cutting this spiral, but I think it's it's kind of okay. Anyway, it's not an oil paint. I'm getting on quite well now. I've cut all this piece as you can see 
you can see there's still a little bump for your bubbles in the plastic but I think those will push out when I've finished um, I have this big section to do now and this section but it's it's not far away I'll be able to take the, the paper off soon so that's taken me about an hour to cut and now I'm going to try taking the uh, paper off let's have a look what it looks like get your fingers crossed rubbing down a little bit but um, it's looking okay I can trim up the curves quite easily um, later if there's any that offend me <laughs> and I'll do this other section after I've been and had something to eat but yeah not bad that's okay What's it like from this side? There we go. You can see some uh, probably little bubbles on here. But that rub out, I think, quite easily. I think it's wise to use some kind of organic design like this because it's not easy to follow the lines. That's just a little tip. You can see some of the curves there, not quite so good, but I can trim those up now at my leisure. There you go, I'll show you the finished thing another time.